The committee on roster today held its first meeting here in Silong. Last week, the government had notified setting up an all-party committee headed by Law Minister Amprin Lingdo to discuss the implementation of the job reservation roster system in the state. The committee has members from all the political party and it will finalize the implementation of the roster and submit its recommendation within 15 days. All political parties who were invited to this meeting bearing one had attended this meeting this afternoon and we are pleased to inform the public that there was a unanimous agreement of the proposed roster as was discussed by all political parties including the GNC who was <coughs> represented by Augustine Marak through video conferencing from Tura. We have decided to forward certain recommendations to the government of Meghalaya. All of these points that were discussed by the committee will be forwarded to the government of Meghalaya for its kind consideration. Few discussions we may be able to tell you here, but few discussions. We also have to write, take the minutes and submit officially to the government of Meghalaya, the Honorable Chief Minister, for his purview of all of the matters discussed in this meeting. There is one point, however, which this committee felt very required to propose to the government of Meghalaya. If a roster system has to be agreed upon by all stakeholders, particularly the political parties, it is important for all of us to have an inclusive approach, wherein all members of all political parties, to the furthest extent possible, should be a part of a deliberation on the roster system. Now we are satisfied with the proposed roster. However, one political party is still not part of our discussions. We have thought it fit to send a proposal to the government of Meghalaya to allow this committee to also give a patient hearing to the points of view of our one main political party that is not part of our discussions and our dialogues. Otherwise, the entire purpose of our sitting will not be inclusive in its nature. We are therefore going to request the government of Meghalaya to include a discussion on the job reservation policy at the earliest so that we may give an opportunity to the voice of the People Party to present its points of view to the committee. Now having said that, therefore, we will at the same time also send a recommendation to the government of Meghalaya to allow all political parties also to do the same exercise because it would be skewed if only one political party would be given that opportunity.